finding a comfortable position. Could be sitting or lying down. Allowing the body to settle, sink in to whatever you're on top of. And as we move into practice, Starting to feel into your motivation for being here. What brings you into this work? What is your deepest source of motivation? Just feeling into that. Acknowledging that this part of you showed up today. And acknowledging your inner healer and acknowledging your inner child. All the positive aspects you've brought today. Feeling the sincerity that you bring. If there is any cynical voice that comes up, just noticing that. Noticing any negative thoughts that may already have entered. It's no problem. Just acknowledging them and returning to the practice. This work really uh, connect us to the deeper intentions that we may have. Intentions that get lost in the shuffle of life. Allowing sound to draw us into the practice as we open up our extraception of auditory perception. Just allowing that to bring us into present awareness. Feeling the volume of the body, the space that you're taking up, the space that you have direct sensory access to, taking in the gestalt of the entire body, allowing it to fill your awareness, holding it with peripheral vision. Kind of soft inner vision in the same way that your eyes can be held soft. Starting to tune in to anywhere in the body that is starting to draw your awareness. Approaching with curiosity, compassion. Bringing in an attitude of loving kindness and warmth to the self.
it's that curiosity starting to get a feel of the spatial map that the sensation occupies. Taking in the length, the breadth, the depth, the gradient of intensity Really getting acquainted with the sensation from the inside. Really leaving your standard mental models for this sensation, pain, tension. Really trying to get new information about how this sensation feels right now. Seeing if you can melt the edges of the sensation with your awareness. Just the loving tenderness that you are able to bring. Imagine that you're softly holding this area in your mind's eye. The tenderness, allowing that area to relax. to expand. To become just slightly diffuse. Paying attention to the edges of the sensation. Gently allowing those edges to move how they want to move. Maybe there's a slight vibration that you're able to feel into. Or a shimmering quality. As your body softens in that area, you might notice a spreading of awareness, of sensation. Of warmth. Just inviting any movement that wants to happen. Not pushing for it, but allowing. And if we hold any part of our body in awareness in the right way, it will start to move with enough time. So we just hold the awareness there until that movement begins of its own accord. Just bringing your attention to this area may have brought an activation wave, may have created a discharge, may have shifted something else in the body. So leaving space for anything that wants to express, if there's a slight discharge like a shaking or a tingling or warmth, the palms of the hands, the fingers, the scalp, the soles of the feet, the top of the feet.
And if you do feel something, just leaning into that sensation, taking in the meaning of it, which is that the body is discharging accumulated stress. And we always want to give the body lots of time when it begins to discharge. Nothing more important to do than to just lengthen out the discharge. Feeling energy move throughout the body. Maybe very subtle. You may get a significant discharge of energy. Either way, your system is getting what it needs as you bring attention to it. And we can trust the body to use this opportunity to move forward its own healing. Our only job is to bring attention to the practice and to allow the body to do the rest. You could allow your face to soften a little as you lie or sit, allowing the small muscles of the eyes to relax, imagining the brow smoothing, the eyebrows slightly widening. The muscles reforming into a more relaxed pattern. You might imagine the inside of the mouth in a slight smile. You can move, even move the muscles of the mouth. Just very slight. Just feeling the impact of that gesture. Experiencing even things that are done voluntarily can be received by the body. The point of the practice is to help the body to relax to allow in more of the sensation that has been disconnected from, disallowed, inhibited, just allowing the river banks of our attention to widen from their normal course. You might feel the body has a response to those words. The body itself may expand just ever so slightly into more receptivity. As that happens, you can imagine the joints lengthening, a little bit more fluidity through the arms and the legs. Just anywhere where you're still holding tension, you can imagine it melting away. You could visualize ice which melts into water, which evaporates into gas. Just allowing attention to drift into an effortless relaxation. Nothing to do, nowhere to be, just feeling the expanse of this moment. Feeling your body's capacity, your mind's ability to stay with your body for this practice. Just appreciating if you've been able to take in a little bit more sensation than usual, than previous practice. Being thankful for that. And being thankful for all the teachers that may have helped you 
any important figures in your life, sending them some loving kindness, anchoring the internal image that you have for each of those people, knowing that you carry them with you. Allowing your awareness now to start to take in the sounds of the room that you're in, or if it's outside. Maybe locating a near sound and a far sound. Bringing your awareness to the rest of your day or evening. Just very slowly starting to put on the clothes of awareness, ready to meet the challenges that lie before you. Allowing a very slow, gentle, gradual readiness to take shape.